Well, what's up folks? Welcome back to the Eagle's Nest. So we have the old Mossberg 810A 30-06 Odyssey back out here. Those have been following my channel since day one. This rifle has been around for quite a while. Haven't took it out in the range for quite a bit. So we ended up uh, actually threading this barrel, putting it on a muzzle brake. Uh, the crown was actually damaged. My son wanted to go ahead and try out what a 30-06 feels. So we're going to get this thing bore sighted in first and we're going to see, you know, back in the day I was shooting a thousand yards and this was one of the rifles I was using. It took me about 11 shots to get on a IPSC plate and I'm kind of curious to see if I have ever proved in as far as, um, you know, a skill set using the same rifle. So we'll get this thing all sighted in. You're using some 168 grain Hornady and it's got some Varget behind this thing, 54 and a half grains. And this thing is around 20 thousandths off the lands. And uh, see how she does. I think the muzzle brake is going to really help out with the uh, recoil. Okay, we're all bore sighted in. Go ahead and take the first shot. Oh, you have a rear bag or no? I don't even need one. Okay. That thing is loud. Well, it's got a very light recoil. All right, so we got this thing somewhat sighted in. A little bit shooting left, but good old Otzi is shooting sub at MOA. Three shots right there. Now, this uh, stock itself is not even bedded or anything. Um, and it is pretty much factory, other than the fact that I recrowned it. So let's try out a thousand yards. Let's see who we can get on target. Okay, 981 yards. Let's see if I can get an impact here. And within 11 shots. Okay, so we got an IP6 target set up. 981. That's what it should be. Yep. 981. Let's see if we can get some impacts. I couldn't see where that was. getting closer <laughs> I think this thing's walking a little bit impact yep so that took one two three four five six so half the shots from my last time, and this is guessing basically the elevation. <laughs> Impact. Huh? Yep. Make sure you get a good preload. Alright. Ready? Huh? Got ready. Right there's your camera. You hit it though. I did? Yeah. No way. <laughs> Too much muzzle blast. <laughs> Ready? Yep. Left. Hold the right edge. Again, little hot gets it first try. You get a first round impact, what the hell? I outshot you in three videos. I don't know, it looks like it goes high. Okay. There go again. Ready? Mm -hmm. You got the whole right more, right? Right? I'm holding right edge. 
All right, hold, hold a half bill right. Oh. The wind died down, is why. I saw the bullet trace. Is that an impact? I think so. Heard it something. Move, though. I thought it was going to be bruised. I don't know if it hit a rock or something, but I heard it smack. It's all sand back there. Yeah. Hold top right. Top right? Yeah, in uh, half mil right. Okay. You saw where that was, right? No, I didn't. Did you? Yeah, one more. Yeah. Okay. I got plenty. Just, just hold, uh, just hold uh, top of plate, center, or right edge. So dead center high. It'll just go right edge, uh, the right shoulder. Favor center a little more. All right. That was an impact. Yeah, that was a good one. Yeah. You have a 208 now? Yeah, should I try the 208? Okay. You got to come up half, um, I say come up uh, 8 tenths. 8 tenths. Right side? Huh? Yeah, just hold just off plate. All right. Impact. Impact. See, I wish I had a spotter. You're making it look easy. Well, folks, uh, there you have it. Actually, Little Hawk is the one that actually loaded all these cartridges. So uh, we got a few impacts with the old Otzi and uh, 208 grain Ooh, ELD. It's doing pretty good. The 168s do a lot better. It's got, it doesn't really have that much power. I think the 308 for some reason on our uh, my f-class rifle has more power at thousand yards so uh but it works what do you think little hawk my shoulder hurts <laughs> your shoulder hurts <laughs> well good thing we had a muzzle break right because that muzzle break really tamed down that recoil but i guess um goes to show yeah we definitely did improve some skill set 980 yards is basically what i was shooting in my my last shooting spot and beginning of my videos on this channel 900 yeah, it was about 990 yards i believe is what that spot was and uh took quite a bit of shots so <laughs> should i try to shoot that no it's got a loose primer pocket it's not safe well there you have it folks the good old otzi your grandpa's rifle 30 out six take out what you got and go have fun because it could definitely reach thousand yards um, this thing's not even bedded it's pretty much factory other than the fact that we recrowned the barrel and put a muzzle brake and um that's it and we're just shooting some hand loads, so go have fun. Uh, take out what you got, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.